Everything looks better in the moonlight. There isn't much beauty in my line of work. Two things make it a little tolerable. A chance to get off world and stand for a few moments in a place like this. And the chance to do something really good. The hope that one day there would be a knock on my door from someone who needed me. Someone that really needed me. That day finally came. The evening she blew into my office like she came out of hyperspace. My eyes were drawn to her like a black hole. It was painful to look away. This was the dame that I had waited for. To validate every miserable day spent rifling through garbage. She was a showstopper and I was bantha fodder in comparison. So, Mrs... Miss... Gates. Miss Mara Gates. Miss Mara Gates. How can I help? Well, Mr. Delgore, uh, I... Please. Call me Prax. Prax? I didn't know where else to come. I need to get to the outer rim. I've not got money, but I do have something. And I think it might be worth some credits. I need to get away, Mr. Telgo. Prax. You're my only hope. I was hooked from the moment she walked in. I might as well have tried to fist fight a Wookiee as say no to her. Especially after she told me what she was running from. Her husband, an Imperial captain, was a real piece of work. He kept her around as more of a trophy than a wife. His tastes ran dark, and eventually she broke. She ran, but ran smart, grabbing something of value on the way out the door. A holocron, which just so happened to contain the plans for a new type of Star Destroyer. A Star Killer. The information would be priceless to the right party, and they'd easily exchange it for safe passage to the Outer Rim. The captain would never find her out there, hidden amongst the farmers and the bandits. She came to me hoping I'd have the right contacts with the rebels. I played it cool, said I'd see what I could do. But it wasn't long before her plan became our plan. I sold it all. Gave away my life for a promise of something magical. Jackson. Xanthi says you've got a lot of nerve, Prax, after what you did. It'll be worth it. Just take a look. You're not asking for a lot here, Prax. This had better be good. This is all take it. You're betraying us both, you fool. It's a trap! <coughs> you Imperial scum. Now then, Jax Tosh, tell me what you know about Ghost Base.